Hello folks, this is Movie Metal Rock McDonald here, aka Jarrett, and um, she'll put in a uh, water bed on Screen Rant that, <clears throat> that Toby McGuire and Andrew Garfield, uh, their rumors about um, them being recasted as Spider Man slash Peter Parker. Has been debunked by the studio and saying that's probably not going to happen and I understand why because they want to be more focused on Tom Holland Spider-Man movie and you know they're probably saying okay these two actors of um, Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire they had their time let somebody else hmm take over <clears throat> let somebody else um Um, take over the character now. I'm like, yeah, because their time as Spider Man has, mm, has been, um, has, um, they've done their, they've done their, uh, deed as Spider Man in the movies. So let somebody else, um, take over. And yes, there's gonna be yes, yes, and um, Doctor Strange is um, <clears throat> it's gonna be a turn. It's gonna be in the movie. He's gonna basically replace place uh, Tony Stark, aka Iron Man. Um, I really don't help how, how I feel about that because to me, putting um Doctor Strange in the movie in the third Spider Man movie. To me, it just feels like, <clears throat> to me, it just feels like, um, it's just uh, going to be a rehash of the first, um, Tom Holland Spider-Man movie, which, which I don't mind the first, um, Tom Holland Spider-Man movie. I don't think it's, it's as bad as everybody says. I'm like, you know, they never mentioned Uncle Ben. I'm like, technically they did. They made reference. He said, I don't want. Peter Parker said, I don't want Aunt May <clears throat> to go for this again. Okay? He's referencing the death of, of Uncle Ben. Ben Parker. I'm like, we've been... Hmm. Okay. Everybody knows... Anybody who doesn't read Spider doesn't read comic books know that knows about Uncle Ben. Knows that he he died. He got, he got killed. Okay, we don't need to do that again. We don't need to bring back we don't mention Ben Parker again. Uncle Ben. Like no. <clears throat> okay, they did they they did reference him in the movie. They just didn't flat out say his name. Mm, and they can't, and they don't keep reminding us about Uncle Ben. <clears throat> okay. And another defense for this movie. Why is he called Iron Man Jr.? Blah, 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 blah. Why does he rely on a suit, huh? Okay, for starters, this is not... This is not a... A direct adaptation of... <clears throat> of a comic book, okay? This is... Remember, this is a different Spider-Man. Okay. This is not the same Spider-Man from Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield. Okay. This is a totally different Spider-Man. The reason why he lies on the suit so much because he wants to be such like Iron Man. Because he looks up to Iron Man. He looks up to Tony Stark. In one of my favorite scenes in the movie. And <clears throat> Tony, Stark, Tony, Stark, Tony Stark. I can't talk. Says he needs to give up his suit because, because he doesn't need to rely on his suit. And towards the end of the movie, he doesn't. He he, he finds out. Okay, I don't need the suit. <clears throat> I don't need the suit to be a superhero. That's one of my favorite parts of the movie. <clears throat> and um. Yeah, I just think I just think uh, Sony just wants 
um, somebody else. I just think they just want to more be more focused on Andrew Garfield, and I have, and I have a, and I have somebody else, a uh, former actress that played Spider Man to be recast again, um, like Andrew Garfield and um, Tobey Maguire again. And I can see why they do this because they don't want to be, because they want to focus on, because they want to move forward with Andrew Garfield. Now the idea of a live action Spider Verse movie seems pretty cool. You know, I would like to see, um, Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield, and um, and um, battling Electro <clears throat> in the movie together. Having a, that would be pretty interesting. Um, you know, if I'm running it, it looks like Electro would probably be the main antagonist in this movie, which is pretty, pretty dope. Um, pretty interesting. I did read that, that, that Jimmy Foss is returning as Electro. Now, I don't know, is this the exact same Electro from the main Spider-Man 2? Or is it a different Electro, but with the same actor? <clears throat> I don't know. Most likely it's a different Electro, but same actor. You know. Like the deal with um, Brandon Ralph and that um, Crisis on Infinite Earth um, event series they did for the CW where he's, he's, he's playing the same character of Superman. He's playing Superman, but it's not the exact same Superman from Superman Returns. It's, it's a totally different um, Superman. Um, I just, no, I'm not too disappointed about this, but at the same time, I would like to see it, though. So, but, but I know the reason why they didn't do it, because they want to be, like I said, I keep holding this in. They want to be more focused on Tom Holland, Spider-Man. They want they want this to be a more Tom Holland um centric Spider Man movie. Which I don't mind. I don't mind Tom Holland as Spider Man. Now is he the most comic book accurate Sp Spider Man Spider Man we had? No. I think the closest to a Spider Man accurate movie will probably be the first um the Maze of Spider Man. <clears throat> and even that is not one hundred percent accurate to the comics. Because from what I understand, um, Doc Ock killed um Captain Stacy and not the um the lizard. So, like I said, there's no combo movie out there that's 100% like the comics. Um, well, like I said, I'm not disappointed, but I would like to see it. But, you know what, that's all I gotta say. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to rate and subscribe. And see you guys later. Bye.